Right. Coals in. Joe, do me a favour. Uh, don't tell Mummy that I'm literally lighting the coals in two minutes. Et voila. I know you normally like your steaks quite rare, and uh, I think the second time I sent Joe through, it still was, but then it got cold, so I had to put it back on. I told him I was coming. How much time do you think has passed since I sent him? A couple of minutes. Wow, OK. Harper is a real problem. It has to go now. You're being ridiculous. Am I? OK, so you stood me up the other day because you got no sense of time when you were using it. Your food's getting cold while Joe and I sit out here having the family barbecue alone because you don't even know what's going on. I mean, it's affecting the family, isn't it? Oh, come on! <laughs> are you splitting up again? No, absolutely not, darling. Well, why are you arguing? OK, well, why, don't we, uh, why don't we nip it in the bud? OK, would you rather spend time with your son and me or with Harper? With you two, of course. OK, then we have to bin it. Joe used it for his Viking homework again yesterday. See? He does have his uses. He helped me learn about Viking funerals. Can we give him a Viking funeral? That is an excellent idea, son. Uh, yes, I think that has stopped people from being tempted to fish it out the bin, wouldn't it? So, all those in favour of a Viking funeral, hands in the air. <laughs> Carried. Well, it's not exactly environmentally friendly. Well, on this occasion, I think I'll make an exception. Right. Go on, Mum. Say something. Yes, darling. Say something poignant. Something for the ages. In your brief time with us, you have affected all of our lives. Yeah. Sorry it's come to this. So, this is a one-time only deal, OK? Oh, yes, absolutely. We, we do not condone this sort of thing. Do you understand? Yes, it's OK if you do it. It would be bad if I did it. Well, exactly. Wow, look how quickly he's burning. Please send it off. I did. Joe, stand back, OK? We're going to get some water. <sighs> yeah, there's a perfectly reasonable scientific explanation for this. I'm waiting. I think we never speak of this again. Old school. I like it. Well, he's out for the count. Not exactly traumatised. You're missing your friend. Have you suddenly acquired a taste for hospital food? Because that could be where you're fast-headed. You know, there is uh, one thing that I could do for you that Harper never could. Well, I suppose the technology will have to catch up one day. But for now, you'll have to do.